Good morning. I do know what time it is. It is February 9th, Sunday, 2020. Early in the morning. Well, not early. I've been up since 5 or so, but it's probably about 9.15. Gonna go see my mom pretty quickly before she goes off to church. If she goes today, it's kind of cold out. Well, it's gonna be warm. It's gonna warm up quick. But I want to share one lesson quickly with you, reinforcing what I always say, the importance of learning to recognize intervals. And, and there's ways to do it using uh, tricks, uh, cheat songs like a, a, a fifth interval. Dun, dun. That is the Star Wars opening two notes. Or it is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, Twinkle Twinkle. And uh, here comes the ride. That's a fourth, a perfect fourth or perfect fifth. And there's one for every interval. Then you can have them for going up or going down. I find it's easy just to have one set going up and then just reverse it when you need to, when your notes are going down to check the interval. So this way you can write a song on a bus without being in front of the piano. Well, what made me want to do this uh, reinforcement lesson was I was just singing the old Andy Griffith show tune and Mayberry RFD is special to me because I, I made an arrangement for that kind of tune of my own long ago but all right I quickly got every interval for that melody in my head and just sat down and played it earlier with no mistakes I even started on the right note so besides learning to recognize intervals you can find out what your lowest note is in your range there's a f. close enough half step off maybe but so you f. and that's mostly true for most guys and and um my high notes i'm sure is not going to be really high right now but anyway so i knew that my song started on that f and so it's um Da dun dun. So first thing I did was dun dun. That's here comes the bride. So I skipped that second note. Dun dun. Da dun dun. So da dun. That's the major scale. Dun dun. One two four. So, and then da dun dun dun. So from that third note to the fourth note, it's a fifth. So I got that much. Dun dun dun. Da, so that's just a walk down from the in a, in a, uh, the dominant scale. It's da, 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 da. So that's a whole step from that. Da, da, da. So I'm going to turn to the keys now and we'll look at what I did and why this is important, how easy it was for me to play this melody within a minute of time from experience and learning intervals. So da da da, I knew it started at F. There's your fourth. There's your fifth. Da da da. There, there's one mistake. Because now I'm just going, going on, getting on with it now. But if you sit down, you can figure out all those intervals. Uh -huh, uh -huh. There's a major third. Uh -huh. Is that right? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Here's a minor third. Mi so da 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 da. From the sound of music. Da 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 da. All right. So most important one is here comes the bride, the fourth, the perfect fourth. All right, let's just play the whole thing in a different key. Sorry, don't see. One, two, four, up a fifth. All right. So learn your intervals, people, like I'm always saying. And I love you. Go out and love everybody. Yes. You'll be feeling better for it. Learn those intervals.